Hi everyone. Today's project is this Garmin New V. Let's see, it's a 2639LMT. Uh, it's going into a boot loop when you try to charge it. And it just seems to be stuck trying to boot up over and over and over again with uh, no end in sight. So, usually, the first thing you want to do to try and fix something like this on, on uh, most electronic devices whenever possible, you want to try and flash the firmware. So, in this case, we'll, uh, we'll try that first. And uh, that search is going to start on the Garmin website. And I'm going to see if I can go ahead and find the firmware for this. All right. Plugging this into a computer brings up a different display. Um, this icon wasn't here down at the bottom before. This indicates that it's plugged into a computer. It's stable now. It's no longer in a boot loop. So we may be on the right track and I'm gonna continue to pursue this further. Over here on the computer, where the Garmin web support website, and we want to run a search for the product that we're working with. It's the Nuvi 2639 LMT, right there. And we just look it up. This could be either power and charging or device performance. Um, since we're assuming that this is a, a firmware issue, we're going to go ahead and go for device performance. And the reason for this is this is the fastest, easiest solution that we can try. It's something that doesn't cost money, it's just simply reinstalling the firmware. And we can do it immediately, we don't have to go out looking for parts. So, we'll go update the software on Garmin device. And this uh, first step right here, download and install the Garmin Express. And then here on Chrome, you end up with a uh, download in the uh, lower left hand corner. You click on that to open it. Would be different on Edge or another browser. But. So we'll click on Launch Garmin Express. It appears to already be installed on my computer. And so we choose Add a Device. Add Device. Real convenient. It's all uh, just a matter of point and click. Don't want to register, not in this case. Mm. Tools. Content. All right, so install all updates except continue. And then we're going to go ahead and pause the recording while this uh, does its job. Okay, we have given it enough time to complete the updates. Now it's time to uh, turn our attention back to the Garmin itself. And we check to see what our status is. And it's 
powering up. It's all scratched up. We'll just pull this off. Here we go. We get a better view here. Just waiting for it to complete the boot process to verify that it's fixed. Looks like everything's successful so far, but we want to see it through and make sure that this is working. And there we go. We have our setup screen asking to, ch to uh, accept terms and conditions, yes, install the updates. It looks like this is going to be successful, so I would call this one a win. Alright, so uh, thank you for watching and we will catch you in the next video.